and salutations, my bewitching magicians. I'm Water Witch, and it is with great pride and pleasure that I welcome you all back to Undertale. Now, last time that we were playing this beautiful, beautiful game, we had explored more waterfall, picking up right where we left off from when me and Megan played it in a previous stream, and there was a lot of audio and video lineup issues, and there was awkward shenanigans, and a lot of voice acting, and... Yeah, this this was pretty much going to be the same as last time, except we're going to be um, going further than we are now, and hopefully the audio and video will actually line up properly! I can't say that for sure, since, you know, I can't predict the future, and I don't know how e what editing is going to be like, but hopefully, fingers crossed, things will be back to the way they should be. So with that out of the way, let us continue with the adventures of Fugo! You know, quite honestly, with all of the trash and junk that's down here, it really says a lot about how much humans disregard things when they are no longer of any use. <laughs> it's kind of sad, actually. It's a cooler. It has no brand and shows no signs of wear. Inside are a couple of freeze-dried space food bars. Take one? Yes. You got the astronaut food. Yay! Astronaut food! Woo! Yeep. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sorry guys, had to respond to a text. Since apparently I am no good at multitasking. It's a DVD case for an anime. Desperate claw marks cover the edges. Well, hello, Mr. Dummy. How are you today? Seems like a regular training dummy. Do you want to beat it up? For the sake of my own sanity and for the sake of being a good person, no. You stare into each other's eyes for a moment. <laughs> and that is enough of that reference for now. <laughs> Mistakes have been made! Ha 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 ha! Too intimidated to fight me, huh? I am a ghost that lives inside a dummy! My cousin used to live inside a dummy, too! Until you came along! When you talked to them, they thought they were in for a nice chat! But the things you said! Horrible! Shocking! Unbelievable! It spooked them right out of their dummy! Human, I'll scare your soul out of your body. We done goofed. Now Mad Dummy is blocking the way. Um, check. Mad Dummy, attack 30, defense, yes. Because they're a ghost, physical attacks will fail. I just love how defense is just yes. <laughs> futile, futile, futile. Get him, guys! Ow! You dummies! Watch where you're aiming your magic attacks! Hey, you! Forget I said anything about magic! Oh, yeah, of course, uh, of course, you said nothing about magic. <laughs> Absolutely not. I'll defeat you and take your soul! Ah, Jesus. Ah, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus Christ. It would help if I could- Oh, dear. Mad Dummy is doing an armless ska dance. Huh. Love yourself! I love you! Your HP is maxed out. I'll use your soul to cross the barrier. Mm -hmm. As you can see, I am absolutely horrible at this game, pretty much. Mad Dummy glares into a mirror, then turns to you with the same expression. All I can think about is that vine with the... I don't know if it's supposed to be a squirrel or a hamster or a guinea pig. I don't really remember, but it's just the... Dun, dun, dun. It's, it's, it's pretty great. <laughs> I'll stand in the window of a fancy store. Rip. 
You look nice today. Your HP was maxed out. Then everything I ever I want will be mine. Mwah -ah -ah. Ouch. Mm. Mad Dummy is getting cotton all over the dialogue box. Honestly, dude, we're in the middle of a fight. Can you please try to keep yourself neat? <laughs> huh? Yeah, I guess that'll avenge my cousin. What was their name again? Some cousin you are. Imagine how awkward it is at the family reunions. Aw oh, man, it didn't hit him. Whatever, whatever, whatever! Oof. Futile, futile, futile! Futile, futile, futile! Hey, guys! <laughs> dummies, dummies, dummies! Remember how I said not to shoot at me? Well, failures! You're fired! You're all being replaced! <laughs> now you'll see my true power. Relying on people that aren't garbage! Uh, sorry, had to check something real quick. <laughs> that was awkward. Mechanical words fill the room. Dummy bots! Magic missile! I guess you can say he casts magic missile. Ooh. Ouch. That hurt. An illustration of a hug. Your HP was maxed out. Dummy bots! Try again! Woo! Mad dummy glares into a mirror, then turns to you with the same expression. Again. Dummy bots! You're awful! Oh, Jesus! Ah, Jesus! Ah! Dummy bots! Final attack! Ah, oh, Jesus. Oh, no. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, golly. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Ah, <laughs> These guys are even worse than the other guys! Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? I don't need friends! I've got dives! I'm... out of knives. But it doesn't matter! You can't hurt me and I can't hurt you! You'll be stuck fighting me! Forever! 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 <laughs> what? What the heck is this? Ugh! Acid rain? Oh, forget it! I'm out of here. Bye. Blocky bloke. Sorry, I interrupted you, didn't I? As soon as I came over, your friend immediately left. Oh no. You guys looked like you were having fun. Oh no. I just wanted to say hi. Oh no. Well, I'm going to head home now. Oh, um, feel free to come with if you want. But no pressure. I understand if you're busy. It's fine. No worries. Just thought I'd offer. Well, I'd say that that went well. What do you guys think? You think that went well? I think that went well. I'm feeling pretty good about it. Yeah, it all's, all's good. Everything is well. Let's keep going. Hey, my house is up here. In case you want to see. 
Or in case you don't. Okay! You feel a calming tranquility. You're filled with determination. Yay! Doesn't seem like anyone's home. Undyne has the coolest house I've ever seen. <laughs> what? 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 It's a living. Mm -hmm. Low key, the in exchange in exchange for living there, the dummy is pretty much Undyne's training dummy. Must be a pretty good system. It's locked. Oh. Oh. You really came. Sorry, I wasn't expecting that. It's not much, but make yourself at home. Oh. Are you hungry? I can get you something to eat. This is a ghost sandwich. Do you want to try it? You attempt to bite into the ghost sandwich. You phase right through it. Oh. Never mind. Ah, Jesus! Papa beds! No! Go away! No! 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 Yes, please! Close! Please! Jesus! Ah! My goodness! I bet you guys can't see it because of the recorder, but... Ugh! Oh, Jesus. Okay. Back to- back on track. After a great meal, I like to lie on the ground and feel like garbage. It's a family tradition. Do you want to join me? Sure, bud. Okay, follow my lead. Here we go. You'll lie down as long as you don't move. So, only move around when you want to get up, I guess. Let's all have an ex existential crisis with naps to Bluke. In the end, sometimes it is the quiet ones that know the true meaning of life. Tis beautiful, is it not? Stanley, I think I feel happy. For the first time in a long time, I actually feel happy. It is wonderful. It is glorious. It's unlike anything I ever could have imagined. And I hope that it stays this way forever. Because in the end, it is not a higher being that can give us happiness, but ourselves. We are our own god. And as our own god, we create our own fate. Tis beautiful, is it not? Well, that was nice. Thank you. You still need to recover after all that lying down. <laughs> Let's just do laps from one end of the wall to the other to recover. This CD is labeled Spook Wave. Play it? Sure. This CD is labeled Spook Tunes. Play it? Oh, that's my TV. There's a show I like to watch on it. Sometimes. The, the computer's internet browser is open to a music sharing forum. That's my Blukey! Oh, Blukey, time to explore the rest of the place. What the heck is that music? Uh, I don't know, dude, but it's spooking me out. This is worse than Shiren. 
No way. Sharon is way less scary. If you're so scared, why do you keep winking? These are winks of fear! Forget it. This beat is too... filthy. Wash, wait, don't leave me! Is this creepy music my punishment for being creepy? Please stop. I'll never creep again. Ah! Bet y'all didn't know that you could do that, huh? I is smart. Feel a calming tranquility. You're filled with determination. Fugo is on to the snail race. Awkward. I'm working right now. I mean, welcome to Bluke Family Snail Farm. Yeah, I'm the only employee. This place used to get a lot of business, but our main customer disappeared one day. Now it's just some hairy guy that shows up once a month. <laughs> it's a snail. For some reason, you can't help but wonder what it tastes like. Toriel, she's conditioned us. Snail, snail. A long journey extends in front of you. Snail, snail. Reach far and stretch beyond the horizons. Snail, snail. So snail at Sam Buell. I've been long overdue for a second house. This snail is counting dollar bills. Do you want to play a game? It's called Thunder Snail. Snails will race, and if the yellow snail wins, you win. It's 10G to play. Sure, why not? Okay, press Z repeatedly to encourage your snail. Ready? One. Strategy, strategy, strategy. Come on, come on, come on. Nope, Red's gonna win. Oh, you both tried your best, but the snail looks discouraged. Her best wasn't good enough. Oh. <sighs> Sorry, snail. Just keep on trying. You can do it. You are a good snail. S Yellow is best snail. Yay. All right. Onwards we go! Whoa there! I've got some neat junk for sale! What you looking for? Thanks! Uh, uh, uh. Thanks! I've been around a long time. Maybe too long. Studying history sure is easy when you've lived through most of it yourself. <laughs> eh? You don't know what that is? What are they teaching you kids in school nowadays? <laughs> That's the Delta Rune, the emblem of our kingdom. The kingdom of monsters. <laughs> Great name, huh? It's as I always say Old King Fluffy Buns can't name for beans. That emblem actually predates written history. The original meaning has been lost to time. All we know is that the triangle symbolizes us monsters below, and the winged circle above symbolizes... something else. Most people say it's the angel from the prophecy. Oh yeah, the prophecy. Legend has it an angel who's seen the service will descend from above and bring us freedom. Lately, the people have been ta taking a bleaker look outlook, calling that winged circle the angel of death. A harbinger of destruction, waiting to free us from this mortal realm. In my opinion, when I see that little circle, I just think it looks neat. <laughs> Everyone should strive to be more like him. <laughs> King Fluffy Buns, he's a friendly, happy-go-lucky kind of guy. If you keep walking around long enough, you'll probably meet him. He loves to walk around and talk to people. Hey, why do I call Dreamer Fluffy Buns? Oh, that's a great story. I don't remember it. 
But if you come back much later, I'm sure I'll have remembered by then. Undyne? Yeah, she's a local hero around here. Through the grit and determination alone, she fought her way to the top of the royal guard. Actually, she just came through here asking about someone who looked just like you. I'd watch your back, kid, and buy some items. It might just save your hide. Wha -ha -ha. Be careful out there, kid. Yes, sir. Water break. Duh. Okay, then. Woof. Well, wasn't that a nice story? <laughs> <sighs> Hurt, beaten, and fearful for our lives, we surrender to the humans. Seven of their greatest magicians sealed us underground with a magic spell. Anything can answer through the seal, but only beings with a powerful soul can leave. There is only one way to reverse this spell. If a huge power equivalent to seven human souls attacks the barrier, it will be destroyed. But this cursed place has no entrances or exits. There is no way a human could come here. You will remain trapped down here forever. Well, that's a bit of a downer of an ending. I'll do it. I'll suffer, y'all. It'll be great. We'll all be besties. <laughs> Jemmy, are you okay? No! Hi! Ugh, F you, Aaron. This, ha this had nothing to do with you. They tell Aaron to go away. He agrees. You earned 60 gold! Whoa. But do, but do, but do, but do. And here? We have one of the greatest places in the underground. You feel... something. You're filled with determination! Boop! Hi! I'm Timmy! And this is my friend, Timmy! Hi! I'm Timmy! And this is my friend, Timmy! Hi, I'm Jimmy. Don't forget my friend. Hi, I'm Bob. <sighs> we should all strive to be more like Bob. Oh, I'm a baba. Human, such a good. Tim, watch egg. Egg will hatch. Tim, why parent? It's hard boiled. Statue of Tim, very famous. Very. Mm -hmm. Feeling of being watched. Mushroom dance. Mushroom dance. Whatever could it mean? It symbolizes my inner torment trapped here by my haifa. My struggle to pull away. My struggle to escape. But alas, to no avail. Why is everyone down here so dark? But Tim heard human allergics to Tim. They're okay. Tim understand. Tim also allergic to Tim. Hives! Yeah, I agree. Should check Tim shop. Which mm -hmm. history of Tim? Well, let's check out this Tim shop. Hi! Welcome to the Tim shop! Mm -hmm. Shoes for 103G! <laughs> 
Yay! Yeah! yeah. <gasps> oh, that's right! I have dog residue! Well, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> I do believe that it is time for me to see how much of this I can farm. <laughs> Use the box? Yes, please. <sighs> the rest of your inventory fills up with dog residue! Yay! Use the box? Yes, please. And don't worry, I'm not gonna be grinding for too long. I'm just gonna try to get a bit more money than I do at the moment because, yeah, I'm gonna need a lot of supplies later. <laughs> Use the box? Yes, please! Hi! I'm Jemmy! Hi! I'm Jemmy! Us tents have a deep history. Yeah, yeah! Go to tent shop! Since I know that I can't exactly keep on doing this back and forth for the length of a, for the length of the rest of this episode, since I'm gonna try to keep it under half hour, let me know in the next let me know in the next episode. Wait, or let me know in this episode's comments below if you want me to send to grind enough to get Temmie to college so that we, we can get the Tem armor, and also if you would want that to be its own episode. Use the box. Yes. Because I'm going to try to to get out a little bit more. But yeah, let me know in the comments below if you want me to dedicate an episode to getting Temmie to college. Because now I'm going to try to progress a bit. Well, nope, nope, don't want to sell any of that. Sorry, Tam, you don't really have anything that I need right now. Bye! <sighs> anyway, let's progress. Goodbye, Tams! I might come back later! You walk into Mold Small. Bye bye. Not dealing with you. Without candles or magic to guide them home, the monsters use crystals to navigate. Learn something new every day! Oh, dead end.
Hmm? Wash one, Aaron appear! Tell Aaron to go away. He agrees. Dar out, darn spot! Oh dear. Oh my. Oh my. Oh dear. Ah, Jesus. You asked Washua to clean you. It hops around excitedly. Green means clean! Yes. We earned 55 gold! Sorry, I got way too into the music. Behind you. Ooh, snap! We got Sundine up in here. Sup? Seven. Seven human souls. With the power of seven human souls, our king, King Asgore Dreamer, will become a god. With that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier. He will finally take the surface back from humanity and give them back the suffering and pain that we have endured. Understand, human? This is your only chance of redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body. I'll help you fight! <gasps> Yo! You did it! Undyne is right in front of you! You've got front row seats to her fight! Wait, who is she fighting? Hey! You aren't gonna tell my parents about this, are you? MK is in troubles. Hmm, nothing there. Upwards we go! You hear a passing conversation. Hmm, if I say my wish, you promise you won't laugh at me? Of course I won't laugh! Someday, I'd like to climb this mountain we're all buried under. Standing under the sky, Looking at the world all around, that's my wish. <laughs> hey, you said you wouldn't laugh at it. Sorry, it's just funny. That's my wish too. No. However, there is a prophecy. The angel, the one who has seen the surface, they will return and the underground will go empty. But how it goes empty, that is the question. Yo! Yo! I know I'm not supposed to be here, but I want to ask you something. Man, I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, yo, you're human, right? <laughs> Man, I knew it! Well, I know it now, I mean. Undyne told me, um, stay away from that human. So, like, um, I guess that makes us enemies or something. But I kind of stink at that. <laughs> yo, say something mean so I can hate you. Please? Yo, what? So I have to do it? Here goes nothing. Yo, I... I hate your guts! Man, I... I'm such a turd. I'm... I'm gonna go home now. 
And how can they still talk? Come on, come on, MK. Come on, get up, get up. I got you, man. I got you, man. Yo, dude. If if you want to hurt my friend, you're gonna have to get through me first. Well, if that's the case, then um. Screw this crap, I'm out! <laughs> She's gone. Yo, you really saved my skin. Guess being enemies was just a nice thought. <laughs> we'll just have to be friends instead. Man, I should really go home. I bet my parents are worried sick about me. Later, dude! He didn't trip this time! But, if I remember correctly, then I think that the ultimate battle of Waterfall is about to commence. But wait, how did- wait, wait a minute. How did Undyne walk to the left it, from where we just were, but then somehow end up here? It makes no sense! She has sand syndrome! Anyway, though, <clears throat> seven. Seven human souls. And King Asgore will become a god. Six. That's how many we've collected thus far. Understand? Through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, as is customary for those who make it this far, I shall tell you the tragic tale of our people. It all started long ago. No. You know what? Screw it! Why should I tell you that story when you're about to die? Nah! <coughs> My throat. Ahem. <coughs> you! You're standing in the way of everybody's hopes and dreams. Alphys' history books made me think humans were cool. With their giant robots and flowery swords, women. But you? You're just a coward. Hiding behind that kid so you could run away from me again! And, and, and something's been bothering me too. The whole time I was chasing after you, I felt something s strange. The echoes of something warm. Something, something like I miss being friends with you. But that's ridiculous. I would never get chummy with a coward like you. You, you must have been mind controlling me. Manipulating people to make them like you. What a great A freak. Now enough for everyone's hopes. For everyone's dreams, and for my own freaking dignity, I, Undyne, will knock you down. Welp, you're just gonna have to knock me down in the next episode. Because <laughs> we're about this at that point where it's time to, um, end things up for now. But yeah, let me know what y'all think in the comments below, and I'll see y'all next time when I most likely die to this... Swordy Fish Lady. Ladies, every peoples!